Hi everyone, lately fishing has been very good for me and I'm so happy that I've caught another one of my favorite fish which is the finger mark bream and this time is bigger than the last one that I, I've caught so I'm really excited to cook it so let us start the preparation this finger mark bream is about 1.2 kilos as the fish get bigger that uh, distinctive uh, black spot in this area gets sort of like faded so it's not so obvious anymore however you also notice that the bigger fish has a richer uh, a richer in colors this one is a little bit more orangey so it's a beautiful fish in my opinion now this fish is um, too big for me to consume alone so what i'm going to do is that i will cut away the heat and uh, keep it for another day. fish has been cut up to uh, two fillets actually for this side one part of the fish fillet I purposely left the skills on because I'm going to try to do a dish for the very first time which you will find out eventually and these two sides of the fish I will probably keep them to make fish soup season the fish fillets with just uh, some salt and the oil is also getting ready so we're going to do some exciting cooking
This is my surprise dish for myself. It's the first time I'm doing this. Mm, let's have a taste first. Let's eat the fish as it is. As I always say, finger mark brim is really one of the best fish to eat. So even I have um, done this method, the flesh is still moist and the skin is very crispy because this dish I did not remove the scales. The sauce that I cook up is actually a dry version of a curry, fish curry. I think it's, um, it, it has that flavour but it somehow is not uh, I would say sourish enough for me, so perhaps I'm missing something. But anyway, I'll give it a try together with the fish. Mmm, all right. That goes well. I feel like I'm dining in an expensive restaurant. But I need to improve a lot to reach that kind of level. So let me continue with my eating. Well, this is my first time trying to cook this kind of uh, style. I would say it's not easy. Maybe the finger mark brim is not so suitable um, for this style in the sense that the scales are quite large and it doesn't sort of like a pop up when the hot oil is being boiled, uh, poured over it. Um, overall, the taste of the fish, as I said, is, is always good. Finger mark brim, it never goes wrong. It's so beautiful. Um, something about the sauce is that I perhaps I have uh, put in too much flour, so it's a little bit um, dry on the dry side. The curry, or rather the, the fish curry taste is there. Uh, perhaps a little bit more soury should be better. So these are the things that I will need to improve, and hopefully the next time I can do it better. So I hope that you like this video and I will see you soon.